Oh, I'm dead. I'll miss being a tree. Oh, are you all right? Uh, what happened? Is it done? Oh, wow. Thank you so much, sir. You really are a great wizard? Yes, that's... Uh, 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 that's my name. <laughs> Going through the voices from my list. Great wizard. Because of the greatness. Mm hmm. I think we have to go to the king now. So he can show me the door. Yes, I... I'll be right there. I have to finish something. I'll be right there. Go on. Go, go, go. Go! Go and never return! I will never want to see you again! You stupid child, you smell too badly. Go take a shower! Sorry. I'll... I'll try my best. Oh! Oh, jeez, Rick! I don't know why I turned into Morty. Uh, welcome. <gasps> it's me. In the future. Everything is fine. No, Mr. Midnight! It feels like heaven. I'm crying Franny, blood. Franny, 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 Bo. Can you see my love? Bloody tears down my face. I'm sitting on a throne of hands and eyes. What are you? Leave Mr. Midnight alone! Enjoyed playing with you again. Can't you see yourself in the mirror? I'm not you! I'm not! Let Mr. Midnight go! Now! We kill the traitors, because that's what he is, Fran. Don't you see? My kitty's not a traitor. He promised me to be my mother by the side. He promised! Leave me alone. Leave my friend alone. I'm the only one you have, Fran. I'm the one who is always by your side. Now, let's get rid of this traitor. Huh? What do you say? Let's be happy. Let's be so very, very happy together. <gasps> Why is it bleeding so much? My kitty. Why? Go away! Go away, it wasn't me! Oh. Oh, poor thing. Fran, what's wrong? Why are you crying? I'm crazy, sir. I'm totally crazy. The doctors were right. But you're not crazy. I'm very sorry that you feel that way. You should be happy now. You found the stones and you become became human again. That is very great indeed. My dear, let me wipe those tears. I don't want to hurt you, my dear. And I feel like I'm about to do it at any moment. You won't. I know that. Because you love me. I do love you very much. Fran, remember what I told you. If you love, you are alive. And that is the only thing that matters. You will always find the power to fight those monsters in you. Now, let's go and open the gate so you can go home. Yes. Yes, let's do this. Oh, poor baby. She's crying. Reminds me of my ass is bleeding. <laughs> my anus is bleeding! <laughs> so stupid. Uh, where's the gate here? Here we are. Yes, but where's the door? Oh, right. I have to make it visible. But are you sure you want to go back? I'm sure, sir. All right. Here we go. A human must leave. Open the secret door into her reality. Let the human return home. Oh, wow. We're going home, kitty. Huh. Oh, is it? Oh, ho, ho. the king. Good day to you. Oh, no, these guys have the same voice, but different actions. I'm brought for stones. This lovely creature can go home. Thank you, sir. I'm very nervous. It'll be strange to be far away from you all. Then, don't leave. I can make you a place to stay. A very magical place. Is that... He's inviting me to go insane. Perhaps I should take that? Hmm. <laughs> Everyone can hear your voice! Hello! <laughs> I 
I'm such a dick. <laughs> How can he be on a train without headphones? Are you insane? What? Wizard, she has to leave. I received a message from one of the Valokas, and she is not ready. Oh, I see. What are you talking about? Ready for what? Come on, wizard. Place the stones. We have no time to lose. But, ready for what? You know what the Valokas told you about facing your truth. Ah, yes. I think I rem remember. Well, should I? Yes, go ahead, wizard, sir. Magic stones create the lock that only the human can break. Human! Uh, well, now it's time for Fran to be the key. You are the only one who can, who can open this now. Oh, wow. All right, let's see. Oh, blah, 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 blah. Aha! Oh, ho! Oh, what? Well, that was super easy! Star! I'm a star! My god, no! I smell victory! Again! You did it, friend. You can go home now. I'm so excited! Oh, I wish I could leave you something so you can remember me. We won't forget you. You are a very special creature. Oh, I almost forgot. Polontrus gave this milis for you. Ma. Ah. Oh, thank you. Does that mean I can type now? Oh, oh, before you go, you must know. Before you return to your reality, you will go through the secret woods. The woods are a kind of invisible passage between our realities. Uh-oh. 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 Terrible creature. And you may encounter terrible creatures that want to uh, eat you. But uh, just run. Uh, they're quite slow. <laughs> Nothing to fear. And you're telling me this now? Huh? That sounds very scary. Don't worry. You'll do fine. <laughs> <laughs> I hope so. Well, Mr. Midnight, say goodbye. Let's go now. I, I like you very much. Goodbye. <sighs> Goodbye, Dreamwell. I'll be a tree never again. Song is so good. Oh! We're doing froggy. But a uh, bit different. Oh, over! Oh! Ah! I have to collect the jump. Oh. <laughs> well, uh, uh. Where's my face? Why is my face just like half. Uh, there you go. What? I like making sound effects when I jump. Even though it sounds like I puke. Watch Skateboard! Uh, I wonder where this monster comes from. Wait, I'm the monster! Because I'm the camera. I'm so smart. Oh. Chapter 4, Part 1. My imaginary friend. Oh! Wait! The jar. Hello? Ah, my goodness. The door opened. Wow. Interesting. <laughs> I love the reaction. Mr. Midnight, look. I think we are... We are at the other side of the bridge. Oh. Wait, how do we... Huh. Ah, I knew it. But where were they going? Wait, why can I do this? My feet, thief. I have to clean them when I get home. I like these boots because they're comfortable and pretty. If they were just pretty, I wouldn't like to use them. <laughs> True. You gotta wear something when it's comfortable. And when it's pretty. Not either or. Well, you can wear it if it's comfortable, I guess. And I guess you can wear it when it's pretty, too. Home! Uh, that must be a trap. Surely it doesn't actually say home. Is it the monster? Oh, fuck! Good lord. I shouldn't have touched the pills. Bad friend. Bad, bad. I have a heart attack. <sighs> um, I have a knife, though. Aha! Finally, my blood, my own blood, the knife will come to use. <laughs> the face. Uh, do I have a mustache? I have a goatee now. <laughs> anyway, we're out. Woohoo! Uh, <gasps> it's him! <coughs> Fran, you're already here! Well, I wasn't expecting you until 235! 
And as I see it, you're not trapped anymore. Interesting. Anyway, let me introduce myself. I am Itward, uh, uh, your faithful friend. I know your name. Do I know you from somewhere? You seem familiar. <sighs> yes, I'm the creature of the night. We've been playing together. I helped you get to Mr. Midnight back. You, you see? Yeah, see? Really? <laughs> huh. I think I managed quite well to find my kitty on my own. Yeah. Damn right. Wait. Hey, aren't you the one that made the sisters mad? No, 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 it wasn't me making this as mad. <laughs> they believed it was me. You see, but that's because they never looked into themselves. Ah, you gotta look and be introspective. Uh, my game, uh, introspective. What do you mean by they never looked into themselves? Well, they blamed me. Instead of fixing the fact that their parents never loved them. <laughs> it says it's, it it's a matter of fact. But let's stop talking about the sisters, shall we? Don't you recognize me, dear friend? The long man with the top hat. I always came by night and told you stories when you were just a little baby. You went, wah, wah, and I told you stories. I came to you after you imagined me. <gasps> but I'm not imaginary, you see. I'm part of your reality!